The PlayStation already had an incredible console launch with new games to showcase the power of the PS5, and now Sony is looking forward into the future with a ton of timed, launch and full exclusive games to keep players excited through the year. A diverse collection of gorgeous games among some of PlayStation's biggest franchises will return for what looks to be another winning year on the PS5 and even the PS4. This is PlayStation in 2021. This is Colt Eastwood, welcome to the channel. Just a couple of weeks ago, I covered the 17 games coming to Xbox in 2021, and today we are going to cover the 12 big games coming to the PlayStation. Some smaller games and some not confirmed to release in 2021 won't be mentioned here, and many of these games will come to PS4 as well as PC, but the offering is definitely impressive. If you end up enjoying this video, let me know by liking and subscribing to the channel, hit the bell to be notified of new content, set your player to 4K60, and let's look at PlayStation in 2021. The PS5 has no shortage of amazing games to play on the new hardware, with Spider-Man, Miles Morales, Demon's Souls, along with Sackboy and Astrobot, giving new PS5 owners something to be excited about. The hype isn't stopping in 2021, with even more, bigger games coming next year. Last week when Lupita delivered an absolute masterclass. Delayed from holiday 2020 to early 2021, Destruction All-Stars is a mishmash of Twisted Metal meets Rocket League in this colorful, character-driven, competitive multiplayer arena racer demolition game. Bright colors, wild visuals, and fast-paced action secures Destruction All-Stars as the next big thing, hoping to draw in players by the millions to fill servers and get players talking. The game looks like a ton of fun and will hit us all head on in February 2021. You're hunting me is the main attraction. A timed exclusive from Arcane, the minds behind Dishonored is Deathloop, a first-person action time-based shooter that relies on quick, perfect reflexes. The game oozes a stylized pulp aesthetic with witty characters and a rinse and repeat dance through death and retry. Deathloop promises stylized, brutal death and assassination with an old world to kill your way through to complete grisly contracts. Deathloop comes to PC and PS5 in May 2021. A surprise visual spectacle from House Marquee, the creative powerhouse behind Resogun and Nex Machina comes Returnal, a visceral third-person shooter that relies on fast-paced enemy shootouts, blur quick dodging, and over-the-shoulder gunplay. The world takes you into a time loop of death and resurrection as you perfect your combat and survival skills in this roguelike shooter coming to PS5 in March 2021. Kena Bridge of Spirits surprised and captured the attention of PlayStation fans at the reveal showcase with Pixar-like visuals, satisfying combat, and traversal in a fantastic pixie world with creatures. Kena has the power to restore the world from its cursed state by defeating evil and freeing spirits. Melee combat and a powerful bow give Kena ways to dispatch foes across the spirit-filled world, coming to PC, PS4, and PS5 in mid-2021. Stray, a lost and alone, separated from a family stray cat, must untangle an ancient mystery to escape a long-forgotten cyber city and find the way home. Stray is a third-person cat adventure game set amidst the detailed neon-lit alleys of a decaying cyber city and the murky environments of its seedy underbelly. See the world through the eyes of a stray and interact with the environment in playful ways. Due to release on PC, PS4, and PS5 in June of 2021. You see things others can't. Ghostwire Tokyo, a city overrun by deadly supernatural forces after 99% of the city's population has vanished. Use a powerful arsenal of spectral abilities to fight the paranormal threat and unravel the mystery behind the mass disappearance. Created by Xbox's own Tango Gameworks that immerses the player in an ominous city with dangers to uncover around every corner. Ghostwire Tokyo comes to PC and PS5 sometime in 2021. Oddworld Soulstorm is a lemon-inspired reimagining on modern consoles, a 2D-style platformer puzzle-based game with the strategic traversal through dangerous gauntlets. 
Abe returns to save his fellow Madokins from slave labor. The game features a new crafting system in which Abe can craft and customize different weapons. While the game is mostly linear, it features a massive train hub area where players can access new levels and new places. Oddworld Soulstorm comes to PS4, PS5, and the PC in early 2021. Solar Ash is a watercolored indie game that captures the charm brought by the recent game, Pathless. In Solar Ash, you will find a surreal, vivid, and highly stylized world filled with high-speed traversal, endearing characters, and massive enemy encounters. The mystery is waiting to be unfolded, coming to PC, PS4, and PS5 sometime in 2021. Ratchet & Clank Rift Apart is the 11th in the series, a staple on the PlayStation. Rift Apart is a true next-generation game built to run only on the PS5 with super vibrant high-quality visuals and performance powered by the quick I.O. afforded by the NVMe SSD and cracking architecture in the PS5. Take Ratchet & Clank through a dimension of bouncing super adventures with an arsenal of creative weapons and gadgets to dispose evil and make it back home in one piece. Ratchet & Clank Rift Apart comes to PS5 in early 2021. Finally, the full Gran Turismo experience continues with Gran Turismo 7 in ray-traced glory around the world on the most famous racing circuits. A racing showcase on the PS5 will show highly detailed cars, tracks, and simulation to bring the feel of speed and grip to the DualSense 5 controller. Gran Turismo 7 promises a fully featured experience only on the PS5 coming late 2021. One of PlayStation's best new IPs, Horizon Forbidden West returns with Aloy in a corrupted afterworld full of returning wildlife mixed with her world's prehistoric robotic beasts. Horizon Forbidden West promises to be a continuation of great third-person open-world action-adventure games. With excellent stealth and combat, that has made this series a brand new hit on the PlayStation. Aloy's adventures take her across storm-filled variety of environments made to shine on the PS4 and PS5. Horizon Forbidden West is due for late 2021. Finally, if the PlayStation lineup wasn't enough to impress, they're capping off the year 2021 with the biggest game franchise and a continuation, God of War Ragnarok. PlayStation hasn't shown any gameplay, screenshots, or anything for this massive game coming before the end of the year, but it is likely built off of 2018's God of War with combat and gameplay additions to push the story of Kratos and his son forward into a new struggle with evil. If Ragnarok is built from the last game like Horizon Forbidden West and Spider-Man Miles Morales, it could likely see a release on PS4 as well as the PS5 at the end of 2021. The year looks extremely good for the PlayStation, and with the hardware making every game shine, there's never been a better time to upgrade to the PS5 as they become more available. Each of these new games will look and feel incredibly immersive on the new controller and give these developers the performance and speed to bring them to millions on the PS4, PS5, and PC. This is Colt Eastwood. Thank you so much for watching. This was a long video. So many great games coming. If you have a chance, check out my Xbox 2021 video. I'll link it here at the end on the screen. And if you made it this far into the video, write in the comments, Telecaster. I'm really excited about 10 of these games out of the 12, and I can't wait to get them at launch. Xbox has about 17 games coming as well, so we definitely have our hands full of new games for 2021. Since this is mostly an Xbox-centric channel, a lot of people may be wondering what my experience on the PS5 has been this far. Actually, I've only got a couple of hours with Spider-Man Miles Morales, as I've been playing most of my time on Assassin's Creed Valhalla and Cyberpunk but I've actually spent more time playing Astrobot and Sackboy Adventure, which are incredible games. 
So far, my experience on the PlayStation 5 as well as the Xbox Series X has been completely trouble free. One of the most difficult parts of being a content creator right now is knowing that there are millions out there who cannot get a hold of a PlayStation 5 or Xbox Series console. And I really think that things are going to settle down as we get farther into the year and the rush for the console slows down just enough for manufacturing to get more consoles available. If you enjoyed this video, let me know by liking and subscribing to the channel. Hit the bell to be notified of new content that comes weekly. If you want to support the channel, you can become a channel member or Patreon by clicking the link below in the description. Each member gets early access to new videos and monthly giveaways. Let me know what you are most excited about on this list. Be a good sport in the comment section, treat others with respect, and please be nice.